This segment is sponsored by Advanced Pain Care. Hey everybody, I'm up here today in Round Rock and I'm talking with Dr. Mark Malone. He is the president and founder of Advanced Pain Care and we're learning a little bit more about all of the incredible technology and medical advances that they work with every single day. Dr. Malone, good morning to you. Good morning, Rosie, thank you. Thank you so much for having us out. I've been hearing that there are a lot of big things happening at APC. In fact, I'm surprised you have four whole minutes to sit down and chat with us. Yeah, Rosie, <laughs> it's exciting day at Advanced Pain Care. We are up to 17 clinics in the state of Texas now. We're building our fourth surgery center. We have three pharmacies and we're up to 30 doctors in eight different specialties. That is pretty incredible and I know that this is all in service to the patients. Yes, absolutely. All of these specialties and all these specialists are focused on treatment of the chronic pain patient. And that includes some specialties that I was surprised to hear about. For example, yeah. addiction. Addictionology is very important because many patients need to be on strong opioid medicine to relieve their suffering until we can figure out other ways to do it. And so a certain percentage of people it leads to addiction and they need treatment for that. Mm -hmm. Wow, so you guys really have a multidisciplinary approach. Yeah. Not only that, you wanted to mention your imaging center. Absolutely. Next year and soon we're opening a new imaging center that will feature MRI machines and CT scanners. Awesome. Yeah. And you say that's an important component. Very important because this goes hand in hand with the treatments that we offer including neurosurgery and pain management. We need advanced imaging of the spine to see where and how we can do these things. I'd like to hear about why you created Advanced Pain Care because you guys have been in business for 20 years. So yeah. congratulations, first right. of all. Thank you, Rosie, so much. Yes, uh, 20 years ago, I was an anesthesiologist in a hospital, working in a hospital, helping do surgery like uh, spine surgery. And a lot of these spine surgery patients were repeat customers who come in for multiple spine surgeries. This is very devastating. And I would see them post-operatively and they'd be in a lot of chronic pain. And they would leave the hospital with nothing but a bottle of pills. So I knew there was a huge demand and need for chronic pain management outside the hospital. I left my practice, went back to Houston and did a year's fellowship in chronic pain management, then came back to Austin and started Advanced Pain Care. Yeah, not only that, but then you found yourself the next couple of years right. as a, a, a patient who they themselves needed some help. Absolutely, Rosie. I got to experience the full gamut of chronic pain. I uh, suffered a severe back injury. I was lifting something heavy. I fell to the ground. I felt a pop. And from then on, I was a chronic pain patient. I was never the same. So I went through all of the usual pain treatments, including the medications, spinal injections, physical therapy. Nothing really helped. I finally had two major back surgeries and even those didn't help, but only made it worse. And this is very common for chronic pain patients. They see all of this, and this is a very typical story for chronic pain. Finally, I got a spinal stimulator, which is a relatively new device that we specialize in here at Advanced Pain Care. I got my stimulator about five years ago, and from the moment we turned it on in the recovery room, I haven't had chronic pain at all. That is incredible. Yeah. I mean, and for you to have the empathy and sympathy to really understand what your patients are going through. Absolutely. You've been there yourself. I have been there, and a lot of people are dis missed when they say they have chronic pain, they have chronic back pain. You know, you take pictures, MRIs or x-rays and you don't see the pain. So a lot of people are dismissive of these patients. They think maybe they're just seeking drugs or seeking disability papers, but I experienced it myself. I know it's real and uh, so we really believe our patients. Yeah, and you really uh, have a lot of different ways to care for them. Um, I'm glad you brought up that spinal cord stimulator because I want to hear a little bit more about it. You say it is the most preeminent big change yes. invention yes. Uh, that has rocked the pain care world in the last couple of decades. Absolutely. The spinal stimulator is the biggest news and the biggest invention in the world of chronic pain management since I've been in it in 20 years. This device is a small implantable device similar to a pacemaker with two wires attached that go into the spine and block pain signals just like noise canceling headphones block noise. The pain signal travels on damaged nerves to the brain and is a unique signal different from any other type of sensation. It's not touch, it's not vibration, it's not hot, it's not cold. It's chronic pain and it's like noise. 
and we can tune that out. That is so incredible that, yeah. I mean, for lack of a better term, you're tricking our brain, yeah. but in a very right. healthy and, yeah. and medicine forward way. Uh, and you say, to wrap things up here, there are many, many millions of Americans who, quite frankly, are living with chronic pain for one reason or another. Absolutely. So if folks are watching this morning, how can they find out more about you guys? Search Advanced Pain Care or Dr. Mark Malone, either one, and we'll come right up. Sounds good to me. Doctor, thank you for your time. Thank you, Rosie. To learn more about what you could do if pain Pain wasn't holding you back. Talk to the doctors at Advanced Pain Care. Go to AustinPainDoctor.com to get help managing your pain today. This segment is sponsored by Advanced Pain Care.